Hello my soccer universe and welcome to another unpacking video right at the start of the Nations League. Um, we have the IHOs actually, all my League BCD teams here in my collection and I'm wearing Scotland because as you've seen from the title, my Nations League, uh, my, not my Nations League, my home Nations uh, collection will be complete after opening this parcel. Now, uh, this comes from my friend Matt that you know from I may, um, videos on my channel where uh, once I made him a surprise, uh, a mystery parcel. And the other time I sent him a uh, birthday gift. So, and you can see all of these linked above. Now, uh, the interesting thing is that uh, during this video where he has the birthday gift, I noticed a certain shirt from a certain um, home nation team that I remember I really, really, really liked uh, back in the day. Uh, I think I listed it in my top three for 2018, I even want to say. 18 or 19, I think it was 18. So a uh, shirt that I was uh, really taken by because I really thought it looked absolutely gorgeous. Um, and he... I told him that it's a really, really nice shirt. That's that, that's the one that stuck. I mean, yes, he has a Fiorentina shirt hanging there and, and so on, but that's the one that captured my eye. Yes, it was hanging very, very, very prominently out there. And he said, if you want it, it's yours. And he sold it to me for a very reasonable price. I think including shipping was uh, just uh, around 30 euros or something like that. So I'm really, really pleased with that because if you've seen that video, um, home uh, in just in general, outside of England, getting home nations jerseys here in Austria, even for Scotland that I'm wearing, and yeah, Matt is not Scottish, even for those, uh, it is rather tough to get to come by those. Uh, it, and it's really, uh, to me, it doesn't make much sense because certain nations here, I, uh, you know, uh, Eastern European nations, I can get relatively easy. Home nations, not so much. So I shouldn't talk as much and just open, uh, cut the package open to reveal the shirt. Now uh, it's also, uh, in case you haven't seen it already from the thumb, th 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 it's also the one team that was missing from the women's Euro. So for that, it's way too late, of course. However, you know, be this may, I always want to have them. And now I do. And we're talking, of course, about this rather gorgeous, beautiful Northern Ireland 1819 jersey. I absolutely love this one. This is so, you know, I love especially the color. You know, you cannot go wrong with the color, uh, with, with the color for, for me. But I, I love that it's so uh, simple, it's striking. It has a very subtle uh, pinstriping effect in there, which adds a little bit to the classic look. Uh, crest, it is just green and white. It's absolutely wonderful. It's a wonderful, wonderful jersey. Um, I can't believe I got this because when I saw this, I, you know, this was a time where I was not, uh, I want to say as freely spending, but you know, it was not, uh, I was not, I did not have yet uh, the means or, uh, you know, even, even the plan to go everywhere. I thought this is a really nice jersey and I thought, hmm, I might never get it. Yeah, goes to show you. If you have connections and if you just wait around, you might just about get every shirt that you want to have. I'm Hope so, hope, hopefully. But this is one I never counted on having. Uh, again, I absolutely love this shirt. Absolutely love it. Uh, this was from that particular year, a one of my favorite European national team shirts. It's plain on, on the back. It's Adidas, uh, cannot, cannot get better uh, than that. What I really like about the Irish, um, the Northern Irish, uh, logo is of course the four clovers uh, there it looks kind of old school uh and uh, what always um i don't say bugged me but i wondered about this why is there no green in that logo but you know i think it's very nice to uh differentiate from uh ireland itself so uh really really happy with that one so yeah um I always thought if I get a Northern Ireland church, it were probably one of uh, the one that was issued for the Euros, which I didn't dislike. 
uh, in 2016, but this one is just way better. Now, I also see there's a very nice detail on the backside of the collar, which of course is the crest. And I always like that Northern Ireland differentiates itself by adding a little bit of uh, blue to the, uh, their green shirt, whereas uh, Ireland usually goes with a touch of orange, sometimes gold. So uh, all really, really, really nice. Yeah, I am super happy. Now I have both Ireland and yeah, I needed the, all the home nations. Now I have them all and I'm very, very pleased. So please la, la, let me know what you think about this uh, jersey. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like these. I will talk to you soon. Bye. Hey, just in case you enjoyed this video, here are some videos and playlists that you actually might enjoy too. Also, please consider following me on social media and actually subscribe to my channel so that you stay updated with everything that happens in my soccer universe. And with that, have a wonderful day. Bye.